treat it right now. Hermela? That's right, Pat. Yeah, officials tell us the victim is a 15-year-old boy. He was part of a Boy Scouts camp in that area when the shark attack happened. L.A. County fire guards, lifeguards rather, tell us he was bit in the hand. And because of the nature of his, his, his injury, he was airlifted here to Harbor UCLA Medical Center where he underwent surgery. L.A. County lifeguards tell us a 15-year-old boy was bit by a shark while canoeing with his father off Catalina Island Wednesday morning. The patient and their father uh, were kayaking uh, just offshore there at Parsons Landing, um, and their boat was bumped by uh, a shark of unknown size uh, and type. During the encounter, the patient had placed their hand in the water, or their, their hand was in the water, um, and uh, they were bitten by the animal. Officials say the teen suffered a hand injury and was airlifted to Harbor UCLA Medical Center to undergo surgery. Due to uh, the injury and the remote location, um, uh, we decided to transport the patient via air ambulance to a local area hospital. Lifeguards tell us the father and son were in the water off of a quiet part of the island. That portion of Catalina Island is, is very secluded. Um, it's uh, it's kind of hike-in only uh, camping along those those portions of beach. Boy Scouts of Emerald Bay tell us the victim was at a youth camp. In a statement, a Boy Scouts of America spokesperson added, our on-site doctor and paramedic immediately provided first aid and called in additional medical personnel who transported the individual to a hospital. Our thoughts are with this young man and his family, and we will continue to support them in any way we can. L.A. County lifeguards tell us the teen is in stable condition as a precaution. They have closed off that area for the next 24 hours. In the meantime, they are working with a local agency to determine what type of shark was involved in the attack. Live at Harbor UCLA, Hermela Argawi, CBS 2 News. Hermela, thank you. Well, it is